What up guys, it's Avery back here with another video of Honest Judgment and this time I'm going to be unboxing this Omen laptop by HP. I know I haven't uploaded in a, a while and I say this every time, but if you've been watching my you know recent videos, you know that I'm going to Japan and a little bit update on that is that I just finished paying off you know my passport, my airplane ticket, three hotels because I'm going there for three weeks. And, um, you know, ideally I want to be, you know, recording videos, vlog type stuff, uh, for the three weeks that I'm there. So, you know, I need a laptop. I actually have a desktop that I built, but, um, you know, obviously I can't bring that over there and I'm trying, to, I'm going to try to upload every single day, you know, because I'm going to be doing different things every single day over there. So hopefully it's going to be around, you know, 20 videos of Japan, which is a lot. But, you know, hopefully if you guys are into that type of thing, you can check it out. But, you know, so I decided I really need a laptop that's, you know, that I'm able to video edit on. And, um, you know, it's good rendering on that. I don't think I'm going to do 60 frames per second because I feel like that's too much because I don't really know how much this laptop can handle. I mean, the guy said it's fine. I could do 60 fr frames, but um, so I'll see how it goes if, um, you know, the first half of it, how long it's going to take, you know, for 60 frame videos. And then, um, I mean, for 30 frames. And if it's like uh, seems to do all right, then, uh, you know, I'll start doing 60 but, you know, so this is the HP Omen. I picked this up off of Best Buy. And um, originally, it's 999 you know, basically $1,000. I guess it comes out to 1029 But, um, you know, this is, it, it's Saturday, uh, you know, the day after Black Friday. And it, it's act, it was actually on sale. And um, what I got it for was for, um, I got it for $921.00. But it, but you know, realistically, it was eight hundred and fifty dollars, so because it was eight forty nine ninety nine, but you know, plus the tax and all that, you know, it, it ended up being you know nine twenty one. So you know, I got this. I w I really wanted to get the Acer Aspire E fifteen because like I've seen so many reviews on it. I've seen so many you know like you can upgrade it you know somewhat by like you know adding a hard drive adding more ram and like you know i, I kind of trusted that computer or that laptop and then they didn't have it they were sold out anywhere and then like even i checked like their website and it says like nobody has it for 250 miles and i was like i didn't really want to um you know i didn't want to order it online because i was just scared you know i get paranoid sometimes when it comes to electronics that you know they're gonna drop it or something like that and um so I was at the Best Buy, you know, looking around at the laptops, and then I came across this, and I was like, it's in my price range. I didn't want to spend this much money, honestly. I wanted to buy the $550 Acer, but, you know, I figured, I you know, maybe I should, I should get the i7, and maybe this will last me a while, you know. So I decided on this, and um, this is the, you know, like I said, the Omen by HP. This is the 15.6 full HD version so 15.6 means that's how many inches the laptop is there is a 17 inch laptop and then there's also this I think both of them but I know for sure this model has a 4k screen I just got the original you know full HD 1080 1080 you know uh, screen so full HD pretty much means it's like you know 1920 by 1080 the screen resolution so a little bit about this laptop because uh there's not really a lot in the box. I mean, I could show you, but like, I guess this tells you the specs right here. Sorry, you can't see really, but here are the specs, but I'll just read them to you. But, um, yeah, so there's nothing really on the back. It's like, I mean, it's just a nice logo that says Omen. And then, you know, it'd be cool if the specs were right here and like a sample of the laptop of what it looks like. But um, there's nothing. It just says, like, you know, do not load transport packet if damaged. And then Intel. And then there's nothing really on the sides, really, besides uh, this one right here. But, um, yeah, so, you know, I'm really excited. I've been wanting a laptop for a while. And, like, I, you know, I just got, uh, well, you don't know, but I just uh, got a credit card. And then I pretty much just maxed it out today on this. <laughs> but it's pretty funny. But, um, oh, yeah, this also came with uh this security you know like norton or whatever this actually came free but um i have norton and i could use you know i could put um, my thing on this but 
I don't know. I don't know what I should do with this. Do you guys want it? Or, you know, or, yeah, I don't know. I could give it away. I could, you know, not do anything with it or just save it because it's a free year pretty much. But, yeah, this is just going to be an unboxing. There's not really a review because, you know, I haven't used it or anything. So let's just see what this comes with. So let's just open it up right here. All right. So the first thing you see is that you notice that it comes with this paper mat type of thing. Sorry for the glare. Um, pretty much the front of the box. And, you know, yeah, it's literally just the front of the box. And um, so this is just pretty much a quick start guide on, um, you know, how to plug in, you know, to the AC, like how to plug it into the wall, how to plug it into your laptop, where the power button is, and then just um, telling you where all the buttons are, just like a quick start guide. And this is if you really want to, you know, get into it. it, talks about the terms of service or, you know, the limited warranty it has and et cetera, et cetera. So we'll just set that to the side. So this actually comes in some you know pretty funky styrofoam you know foam packaging i like the design i mean it's like different it's cool i like it you know it's i like it maybe there's a reason for it like or they're just being cheap or you know they just wanted a cool design to look over it but yeah i mean that's pretty cool so the next thing is, is we have these two pieces of paper and um what is this so I guess this is just a uh, technical support and it has yeah it's just technical support and these are all the worldwide numbers that they have so you know it starts from Algeria you know Argentina over here it's all alphabetical order and it, t it gives you their numbers and um, you know where it's gonna be located and then uh, so that's pretty cool that's really nice of them you know that's pretty nice of HP to do that uh, yeah we'll just set that to the side as well and let's just check this one out so this is just a limited warranty and the technical support you know just in fine print pretty much so telling you you know if you like fart on it like in breaks then you can't return it so you know that's it and that's pretty much it that seems to be in the box I mean obviously I'm pretty sure this is the charging you know brick right here yeah so here's the cable for that We'll set that to the side. Here's the brick. There's nothing else inside. But um, the power brick is actually huge, it seems. I mean, like, this is, I mean, it's like half the, like, height of um, the Xbox One power brick. And that's a pretty big brick. It's heavy, too. And, um, yeah, so this is just it. So, yep. And then here's the laptop itself if I could lift it out it's actually really thin let's just set this to the side and see if uh, anything comes like anything else comes in the box so it doesn't look like anything else comes in the box it's just you know is there anything back here no that that's pretty much it Come on, HP, dude. You can't even give me a stick or anything, dude. At least Turtle Beach does. I mean, if you're going to spend, like, $1,000 on this, I mean, like, at least give it some more goodies. This is just, like, the most generic, basic packaging that I've seen. I mean, like, even Xbox One and, like, consoles have more interesting, like, stuff in there. This is just, like, two pieces of paper, or actually three pieces of paper, and then, uh, the, the computer itself. But I guess, like, whatever. So here it is. It comes in uh, just a plastic, you know, bag. And I heard a lot of people were kind of upset with this version. And um, the reason being is because I guess the model before this, um, it was more of an aluminum body, while this one's a little bit more plastic. And then, um, so here's the laptop itself. I don't know if you, the camera will pick it up, but you could kind of see it's like that fake carbon fiber like diagonal lines and here's the logo I don't know what it's supposed to be I don't know if it's like a 
a person with like face like corpse paint on it or it's just a logo i have no clue i like it and um so here it is and then this is how thin it is and the thinness it's a little bit less than an inch it's a uh, 0.96 inches i guess and it's uh it weighs around 4.5 4.85 pounds so it's around you know a little under 5 pounds and um yeah so i don't know if i told the specs about this oh no i didn't so this laptop it has an Intel Core i7 6700 HQ and um <clears throat> excuse me this version like i said it's the 15 inch version and it comes with 8 gigs of ram <clears throat> sorry my throat's really dry it comes with 8 gigs of ram and i think that i've seen online that you're able to upgrade it to 16 i'm sure but um that's a whole process that you have to like you have to unscrew the bottom and then that, find the DDR and where it is I'm pretty sure you can find it on YouTube but um, and so it, it has actually two hard drives well te one of them's an SSD so I'm, that's where the operating system is so after the initial you know first you know Microsoft you know boot up sequence it should be loading at around four seconds you know as soon as you push power four seconds you're ready to rock and roll and then it also has a one terabyte hard drive you know for your games for your music for your photos like that so there's two different hard drives you could do you could use from choose from and um so that's really cool so um you know the acer technically only had one but you could upgrade it so it could have two but the really i don't think it had an ssd though and so i'm really stoked about the ssd and then as the, for the graphics go this comes with a nvidia geforce gta gtx 960 so you know you could do some you know somewhat light gaming you could play overwatch on this thing i don't know if you could play you know battlefield one on high you know obviously you can't but maybe you could play it at like a lower resolution or something and get like those 60 frames i don't know i don't know you, you could check that out online but you know all i've seen really is like you know light gaming and uh you know i've seen overwatch a lot so i know you could play that for sure and then um yeah so this thing has bluetooth and then um yeah so this is the front of it so this is really nice i like this so Here's it comes with an SD card slot, so take that, you know, Apple MacBook Pro, the new one or whatever it was, and then this comes with a HDMI out, uh, Ethernet for internet. Here's where you charge it, and then um, this is a USB three right here, and then there is no disk drive because um, who use disks nowadays, and then here's another USB three. And then a regular USB 2 and then a headphone jack. So let's just open this up. And all right. So it comes with the, you know, the screen protector. And then there's the laptop itself right there. And the cool thing about this laptop, too, is that um, these uh, icons, they actually light up. It looks like they're lit up right now somewhat. But they, yeah, it actually backlights red. And, um, you know, so that's really cool. Um, also, the logo does as well. This logo right here. I think so. I, I, I don't know. I don't remember seeing it. But maybe this does. I don't think this does. I, it's pretty, it looks pretty solid. But the keyboard for sure, I know, lights up. So, you know, I picked this up because I needed a laptop so I could edit it in Japan. So this is going to be, you know, like a video editing thing. You know, once in a while, maybe I'll play some video games. But, you know, I have a designated uh, gaming PC for that. But, um, yeah, this is just an unboxing. And then if you guys want to hear a review, how I think of it, like how I think it handles the 60 frames compared to the 30 frames, how the rendering speed and all that stuff happens, and, like, maybe the games, um, let me know. Because I feel like I want to play The Sims 4. That's what I've been wanting to play. So, you know, I've been too lazy to sit on my computer desk. And sometimes, maybe sometimes I want to lay down and play The Sims. But, yeah, if you guys want to know, uh, hear a review from me, let me know. But this has just been an unboxing of The Omen. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.